Hello everyone. Uh, welcome to the video series on Java Technologies Lab. So uh, in this demo, I am going to show you how to add Apache Tomcat server to the Eclipse IDE. Okay, so by now all of you are uh, familiar with Eclipse IDE. Uh, so first of all, what you need to do is click on the window menu and go to perspective and click on open perspective and go to the other so here make sure that you have selected java e enterprise edition okay and click open okay then you should be seeing uh, your id like this okay then go to the right hand side and you see this icon right which is saying servers okay you click on that now at first you will not have any servers because you didn't add any server so it is saying no servers are available click on this link to create a new server so just click on this link and here <clears throat> select the server type you will see apache go down and we have installed this version right 10.1.5 so click on this and because i have already previously added the server i am getting all these details okay otherwise you will see this link called add so you have to click on this add and you have to select the tomcat installation directory okay so in the previous video i have shown you how to install uh, apache tomcat server right so it will be by default available at this location okay so you just need to click browse okay it will be installed in c drive program files apache software foundation and you click tomcat 0.1 and you click click on select folder that's all that is what you have to do okay and automatically you will see the path like this and you click on finish okay <clears throat> here also click finish right uh, okay so before that let me do something i will tell you what i am doing here okay right so you have added the server it will display like this right so the first thing you need to do is double click this tomcat version timeline double click this and you will see a screen like this okay so don't worry about all this information what you have to do is here where it says tomcat admin port you click on this dash remove the dash and you give some port number like 8000 for example okay so after giving 8000 just click enter and you can close this okay it is asking to save the configuration as save okay right now again click on server now you 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 have you can start the server uh, so you can do it in multiple ways first of first way is right click this and you can select on start okay otherwise you select this okay and you click this green button start the server so i have clicked that now it is showing some error okay so it is saying port 8080 which is required by tomcat server is already in use okay so why it is showing this message you first click on ok it is showing that message because in the previous video when we have installed apache tomcat server uh, the server is already started right so what you need to do is you click on this system tray and you will see something like this you will see an icon like this apache tomcat 10.1 tomcat 10 so just click on this and you will see you will get a pop-up like this pop-up window and you click on stop so what we are doing is we are stopping the server service which is already running okay now you click ok right now again when you click the click the system tray it will show red icon that means it is stopped the server has stopped now here in the eclipse Again, you can try to start the server by clicking this green symbol. Okay. 
okay now you are getting some messages in the console okay so don't worry about all those messages they will just come now you can see the server has started and is synchronized okay so this is all you need to do for adding tomcat apache tomcat server to your eclipse ide okay now you are ready to uh, create servlets jsp pages even html css javascript whatever you want okay so in the next video we are going to look at what is a servlet and how to create servlet so that's it for this video thank you